Hey everybody, Rory from ANS Gear. We've got two head protection devices in front of us today from First Strike. We've got a headband and a head wrap from First Strike. Now, the I'm going to probably screw this up because we were talking about this a second ago. The head band right here is called Lightning, right? Right. The headband is called Lightning. Now, the head wrap is called brick. We're not quite sure why, but that's just what they decided to call them. And that's what we're gonna go with right there. Both of them have lightning bolt designs on them. This one right up here, which um, says is called lightning, has less prominent lightning look to it, but they called it lightning. This one, which you can see has very prominent lightning bolt designs on it, they're calling brick. We're just gonna go with that. So let's look at them. The head wrap, and the headband. We'll start with the headband right here. We can see we have a nice thick protection uh, section on the back of it, nice microfiber or terry cloth back to it, along with a nice thick padded section as well. I like the straps that are easy to fold, easy to knot. I've seen straps that are very, very thick, and that can be hard to tie sometimes when it's on the back of your head. So let's go ahead and tie that up real quick. And then I'll put the second knot in there. Now, you can see the amount of extra material I have. I don't know if I have a giant head or a small head. I, I don't know. I think I just have an average size head. So if you have a smaller head than me, perfect. You got plenty of room. If you have a much larger head than me, you might be getting to the ends of your head wrap and you might need to make a very small knot on there. But anything should work for you. Now, moving on to the head wrap. Again, this one, brick. Uh, is a head wrap style. Much shorter arms on them because you are not tying them, you are going to Velcro them around you. So this one, you can flip it over, put it around the front. Now obviously I'm stacking this double. I've seen a lot of people double up on their headbands before. And that's going to easily go around the back. Plenty of Velcro space on the back. I need to take this one off to really do this. There we go. Now, one thing you might want to remember when you're doing this, some people want to cover their ears, some people don't want to cover their ears. So depending on how you want to put it on there, either you want it to sit up above your ears so your ear is out more like that, or you want to cover your ear. I'm a more of a cover the ear kind of guy because when you're out in the sun and stuff like that, this can help obviously keep your ears from getting burned, which has happened to me numerous times. And then the back to hang down and cover the back of your neck. It's gonna keep the sun off you. It's gonna keep paint off you, dirt off you, all those things. So um, when it comes to protection along the front, we've got the same kind of setup on there. Nice, large protection zone. Let me undo this one so we can see this. You can see equal size on that, equal sponginess, equal protection. But it just comes down to what you're looking for as, as far as what you're wearing. If you want something to just go around your head and you're not worried about your back or your neck so much, uh, or you want something to protect your neck a little bit. When I say protect, I'm talking more about from the sun and dirt than from getting shot. This really isn't gonna help you much if you get shot in the neck. It's still gonna hurt with that hanging down there, but it does protect you from some of the elements that are out there. It's up to you how you wanna do it. But I would recommend one or the other Definitely get out there. You want to wear some sort of head protection always, whether it be a head wrap, a headband, get something on your head. No one likes to get shot up there, it hurts. So protect yourself. First strike, lightning and brick head wrap, headband, available through the website. Order yours now through ansgear.com.